the Hunter Valley. We're in the Australian wine region. There's over 150 wineries here, but not only that, there's cider houses and breweries here. So we're gonna explore as many as we can in one day. Yeah, we're about to go pick up some electric bikes. We're gonna bike around, see as many as we can without getting too drunk. So let's go. That's how you see that you've got power from your battery, so the bike's ready to go. <laughs> We're off. First stop is Bass Creek. Let's go have some wine. That was fun, maybe not going in the complete wrong direction. But anyway, we made it here. So let's go try our first taste of Hunter wine. Good for the tasting? Yeah. Hey. Yeah. 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 So we'll start with the classic Shardy, which is just below that first semi on that you had. How old are you guys? Bit of a mixture. No, <laughs> <laughs> I was. A bit drunk after our first taste, and we're not even finished yet. <laughs> Twenty past eleven. We've not even got onto the reds yet. I'll be honest, I'm not a red fan. But if it's in front of me, I'm gonna drink it. <laughs> so like Laura, not really a red drinker, but this is a Shiraz. It's not my biggest fan. A little cleanse the palate. That's, uh, thank you so much. We're this is the Sun San Gervais limited release. Um, and then you must like normal up a hill and then woo, woo, I gotta keep my eyes on the road. Oh. Something fell out of my basket. Good job it wasn't on the road. Go on, Leanna. Ah. <laughs> Guess I better go catch up. So next up is the cider house. We think this is the only cider house within the Hunter Valley and we've come here because the Scullies, they love a cider. So let's go try it out. They do a $14 tasting paddle. You can mix and match with cider or wine, it's up to you. I've gone for four different ciders, different fruity ones, and Laura's gone for two of each. Ooh. Lemon and ginger cider. Pretty good, that. So we've ordered this plowman's platter. We only ordered it for two people and look how much food we get. Time for the next spot. We're off to Peterson House. That's better. I would help me if I turned the electric on. I was wondering why I wouldn't turn on. Which 
is the Peterson House. They do all sparkling wine. Okay. You would be surprised how many people are like, we don't drink sparkling wine, I'm just like, light tea, don't <laughs> <laughs> bubble, <laughs> giant neon sign that says bubble bubble. <laughs> Subtle lemon lime flavour coming through. We've gone for a five tasting paddle for $15, pretty good value. And they even do sparkling red, so we're excited to try that, that'll be something different. But we've gone for a little selection, we're starting off with a sparkling white, semi long. Tastes good. So this is the sparkling red. It's a Malbec and it says it's with notes of plum and berry. Never had sparkling red before. I definitely get that plum and berry and it's, I'd say, better than a normal red. Can confirm. I prefer it better to a normal red. I'll be honest. I think we are all wined out now. We've been drinking since 10 a.m. It is now 5 a.m. I think it's 5 p.m. <laughs> you see what I mean? It's time to go home. I'm Loz and I'm in Hunter Valley. What? I just want to get you your helmet on. 